So call C function is used to handle the null values in the column and it returns first not null value. So let's see by example. So at here this is the uh, tables. So at here EMB ID first name, middle name and last name. So I'm going to use call C function on first name, middle name and last name column. So let's write the query. So first I'm going to use select and here I'm going to uh, take and here selecting EMP ID. EMP ID column and hereafter I'm going to use call C function. Call C function and here I'm going to pass the columns. So first columns is the first name and here this is the uh, column first name and uh, here after middle name and uh, here last name. So and here first name, middle name and last name. So call C function return not null value. So I passed at here first, middle and last. So that check at here. Oh, uh, is there any null value? So no null value. So that return first not null value. Call C function. So at here the output come S map here after or uh, not null value. So trend. So at here this point of uh, call C or uh, function found null. So that return first not null value. So at here Olivia is the first not null value at there. So that return Olivia. And here that to uh, not found any not null. So that to uh, uh, that not found any null value. So that return chat here. Or uh, this point that's the uh, turn here. So that return and here that found null null and here back here. So at this point back is the first not null value so that return not a uh, backy at here so let's uh, add here uh, give from and here to my table name emp underscore tab so this is my uh, table name and you have to execute this query so see at here or uh, this is a uh, uh, returning first not null values call C function applied on first time middle name and last time and here after that return first not null value so add your is null and if null function generally used to handle the null values so this is the uh, table add your emp so let's execute and this is the record inside the emp table so at here one column there are lots of null values are there so suppose if uh, if you are using is null function if the value is null then that return 1 and if the value is 300 so that return 0 and if you are using if null so if the value is null so that return whatever you give the value and if the value is 300 so that return 300 so let's uh, see by example so at here I am using, uh, going to write to select and here selecting EMP number column and here after ename column and here deputy number column and here I am going to apply is null on com column and uh, here after let's use is null uh, function and uh, here let's pass com and uh, from give the table name emp so emp, EMP is my table now let's execute the query so see at here when the value is null so that return 1 and if the value is 300 so that return 0 500 0 and null then return 1 and here null so this all value return 1 so at here is null it's a, a system generator so if you want to give any meaningful name so at here just write as so this is a column alias 
and here uh, I'm going to write Kami Sat. Now let's execute. So see at here Kami Sat, it's the uh, added. So when the value is 300, so that returns 0, and if the value is null, so that returns 1. So this is the use of is null function. So in place, next thing, in place of this or uh, all columns, you can use a star also. Now let's execute the query. So the star indicates all the columns and here or oh, this is additional column commission. And here if the value is null, so that return 1 and if the value is null 1 and if the value is 300 that return 0. So this is the things related to or uh, SNL function. And with SNL function you can also use aggregator calculation. So let's use select and here after sum. So sum is the aggregator or function and here going to include SNL and in SNL I am going to pass the column call and here after let's close and here after let's give column alias commission and here include the column dpt number and this table from emp emp and you have to are making a group by to dpt number so about the group by i discussed in my last video so please check that also if you like to know more about group by now here after let's execute the query so see at here the output is coming 3 and uh, here uh, for uh, uh, dpt 20 it's 4 and 30 it's the 2 so let's see. So I executed uh, this query, and here after I'm making this query in uh, order by making order by on. So by, by using order by clause, you can uh, display data in ascending order. So I'm going to make order by DPT number. So see at your dpt number so this is three times or when i execute this query so that make the group on dpt number so 10 in one group so 10 is three times and here after 20 so it's uh, 1 2 3 4 times and 30 1 2 3 4 and 5 so total at your five times so and when I make the group, so dpt number 10 in one group, here after that do the calculation. So is null, so add here that uh, dpt number. So when the value of uh, uh, dpt 10 or uh, null, so here that to uh, return 1. So when I execute this query, so when the value is so null, so that return 1. So like this, if you execute this one, so uh, dpt 10 in one group, so add here that return 1. So this is 3 times so 1 plus 1 plus 1 so that return uh, 3. So some at here I am using. So that here that return 3. And here 420 it is returning 4 times. And 430 it is returning only 2 times. Because let us so execute this kitty. So at here 30. So here in a dpd 30 the value is uh, or 30 and here null is only two times so here that uh, 1 plus 1 and or uh, 2 and here after that add 0 0 0 so 2 plus 0 the value is only 2 so that here it's returning or uh, 2 for dpt 30 so the uses of is null function if the value add here so if the value is so null, so that return 1 or here if the value is so any integer value or any string value, so that return 2. So this two things. So I want add here if the value is null. So whatever user enter, so that return and here if the value is 3, so I'm not going uh, so that to return 3 only. So for this you have to use if null function. So add here, let's include if only. 
add here, you have to pass the parameter. So if the value is so, uh, if the value com value is null, so that to uh, in place of null, so I'm going to return one. So let's execute that query. So see right here when the value is null, so it's returning one. Uh, 300 so no any changes 500 no any changes so if you want here you can change you can give any number so at here i'm going to give zero so when the value of null so it's so returning zero see at here it's all zero so like this you can use at here if also and uh, here if null function and here you can have to pass the parameter with is null function you cannot to uh, use any parameter but if null function you can choose the parameter so at a when the value of uh, or count value is so null so i'm going to add with 100 so here if i'm going to execute this query so order by so 10 is the three times so uh, three times that means that add 100 100 100 300 and here or oh, this is uh, 20 and here 1 2 3 4 so that return 400 and for 30 so 30 make one group so first that add or oh, this uh, number 500 5 plus 3 800 800 plus oh, 1400 2200 and here 2 null so 100 100 so that return 24 so let's execute the query so see at here uh, 10 in common group 300 20 400 and this the 2400 so this is the things about is null and if null function so is null function when the value is null so that return 1 or else that return 0 so if null function when the value of null so you whatever user provides so that value that return and if the value is not null 300 so that not doing any changes The case statement is generally used to handle null values inside the columns. So at here this is the rows null values. So, so sometimes what happens some user don't want null uh, inside the record. So by using case st a statement you can handle the null values. So let's uh, see by query. So at here first I'm going to use or uh, select a statement. So at here I'm going to select column EMP number next uh, selecting e name and here after salary column and here after dpt number and the most uh, important columns is commission com so com column has uh, many or uh, null values so i don't want null value display also uh, that uh, let's use at here com and here after i am going to apply case a statement on com column so at your case and you have to use bin bin com is null when the value of com is null then offset the value with zero and if the com value is not null so whatever the value so if the value is 300 so that don't do any changes so this is the things and here after let's use int a statement and here i'm going to use column alias so column alias giving kami and here after from give the table name so my table name i'm using emp So if you execute the query, so one extra column will change it, the name with commission. And here when the inside the uh, when com value is null. So whenever that font the value of com is null, so in place of null that state zero. So let's execute and check. So at here I'm getting the error message. Okay, I forget to give comma. Now let's execute one more time. So see at here, null. So when the value of at here, com value is null, 
then that set the value with 0. So add here null. So the value is commission or 0. So when null and when uh, the value is 1400, so that don't do anything at here. No any replacement. So when that font 0 or uh, when that font null at here, that replaced by 0. So in at here, you can give any number. So at here, this time going to get 1. So see at here when the value of null then add here that change by change by one. So like this uh, you can give any as uh, string values add here. So since my com is uh, integer time, so that I have given one zero. So you can give a uh, win or uh, any enum is a uh, string stamp and in or uh, enum if there is any null values, so you can replace by other as uh, string also. So this is the use of most important use of case statement. So when that font null value, so that replaced by any integer or any string value. And here, if you don't want, and if you want all column to display, so let's skip at here a star and here after comma. So this will display all or column with including commission. So see at here. So this is the com columns. I applied operation or, or calculation on com column. So when that font null, so that replaced by font. So this is the thing. So this is the simplest query.